there the other way. We were up in the car like that. It's the last day. We gotta ship them out right. We gotta ship Lucky out right. We gotta ship them out. We gotta wrap it up like wrap the It's quick. Last day. It's the last day. Ooh. Lucky. Oh, Super Bowl? Yeah. Yeah. I wish Lucky the fucking best, bro. You know, I wish that I hope that he gets out as soon as possible. You know, like, and I hope he's able to come back and come back stronger than a uh, stronger than ever, bro. Good um, coming right here. Yeah, man. You know, this this is our team, man. We as a team, we work together all the time. We've been together for a long, long time, bro. Like whenever we find out our team member try to leave the team and go elsewhere, so the people they always do this and wrap the fucking car and then show show that person loyalty, like you know how much you are important to us on the team. You understand? Know yeah. But for me, I feel sad because he's our brother. He leaving me. You know, I don't know how long he's gonna be down there for, but I feel sad. But I, I wish. I wish him the best. I wish him all the best, bro. You know, that's why you see people wrap the car like this, you know. When you're leaving, maybe moving to another place or something else, you know. You're gonna wrap your car and then they show you the how love we got for you for the team. So this is my better lucky. I got you, man. Thank you so much. Stay here with yeah. us, man. Yeah. We love you. Okay, I try to talk shit there. You know. Picture, picture, picture. We'll be out here. We'll be chilling in the parking lot. Pretty soon, bro. Pretty soon. Yeah. I tell you, bro. That's a good thing. You know, pretty soon we'll be out there chilling, man. Yeah. Let's hope so, man. Telling you, man. Yeah. A lot of you guys know my, my story, bro, but I can't look all the way, bro. I can't look some. And throughout this whole bullshit that I've been going through, to have the amount of support from you guys, like today I'm letting it out, bro. This whole time I've been tough, bro. And it's always said this, man, we're gonna, we're gonna hold this shit in, bro. Like, you know. Cause that's what we gotta do, right? You know, but I appreciate each and every one of you guys for being over there with me. 
you know, making me smile, making me want to come to work, do what I gotta do. Be that family for my family. I appreciate all of you guys, man. Like, more than I can put in words, man. Like, you know, I never thought that today would happen. But it's here, and a lot of things happen in everybody's life. Whether it's good things, yep, bad things. I will be back. Man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure, man. For yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah. it's just a matter of time for everything, man. You'll be back. Just a matter of time, man. You'll be back. Yeah. Yep. And I appreciate you guys for helping me, the person that I am, helping me become the person that I am today. I used to be super hard headed, young. You know, I became you guys' lead man. You know, there's plenty of times where, you know, I've clashed with plenty of you guys. You know, even boss man, like, you know. But throughout the whole time, it's been a learning experience for me. As a man, as a father, most of you guys have been fathers before me. You know, and I learn, about, I learn from everybody. Um... Thank you guys. Man, right. appreciate you. Ain't never too late. Ain't never too late to tell somebody how you feel already, man. Who feel you? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. I'm gonna get up out of here though. I'm gonna follow you. <laughs> Me too, babe. As soon as you leave, bro, I'll be on my way. I'll be gone, gone. You know how people feel like. You know, bro, y'all be together as a team. Y'all work together. And in a blue moon, and somebody just wake up and say, man, I had to be relocated, you know. And this dude right here I'm talking about, this dude right here I'm talking about, he's a guy, you know. He's a good guy, a supervisor. That we all work together in school. Sometimes you come into work late. He said, "Man, you okay, man? You don't have no problem with you." And if you say, "Man, I need a day off," you say, "Man, just tell me whatever, man. I got your back." So today it's gonna be like he leaving us today to go elsewhere. I don't want to talk about where he going because I feel so bad about that. You know what I'm saying? The way he's going right now, if I talk about it, probably I'm not giving the permission to talk about it, but, you know, I don't want to talk about it, but I feel sad. But, you know, we keep watching up, God help him. I guess he'll be okay with him when they come by one day. It's very sad, but I don't want to talk about it. But he's a guy, man. He's a good worker. We love him as a brother, as a friend, give him. As our brother, watch our bike all the time, even though sometimes we do some things that is not right, but he said, okay, y'all know this, it ain't gonna be right, but yeah, you guys are good, you know what I'm saying? But make sure next time y'all do the right thing. He's a good fellow, anyway. Yeah, man, I don't wanna talk much, because I won't get in trouble, you know what I'm saying? So I see you guys, that's all I gotta say for now. Appreciate y'all.